We'll take a look at some open hand versus the stick now. So this is the scary stuff. So you gotta understand your range, you're moving inside and outside. If I don't get the time to move outside, I gotta deal with inside. So he shoots, go ahead, overhead strike. I just spear that inside there. I can wrap and fire, Push my. he pushes my hand over and the strip is there and then you finish right inside there. So we do that one again. So he hits, I hit him, I pass. Whether or not he does anything doesn't matter there because you're just going to seek that emptiness. And he's mashed on the floor, Quinn. Same technique. I wipe that. Whether he or not he pushes my hand over doesn't matter. So if he gets hit, I'm still stripping him right there and hitting him again right there. Grabbing that, pushing him through. Nice. It's scary. So again, we hit. He grabs it and pushes my hand over. There's the strip, there's the hit again, there's the hit again. There's the hit and the finish and the broken ribs, the eyes, the controls, the drops. Check, take his license, go. Now we go to the outside. So that was left hand. This time we'll just spear right hand, hit, seek that emptiness, he either blocks it or he gets hit. Then he gets hit there again, okay? So we move, pick, hit, hit, grab, throw, break, stomp. <laughs> Little compression of the ribs. So Quinn hits me on that one. I fade and I go inside here. There's a strip, there's a hit. Boom, pop. Posh. Right? So we'll go real slow. Zone off. Because if I stay here and do it, I may block that, it's gonna come through and eat me, right? So zone off, wrap, feed that, there's your strip and your hit. Here it can be armbar, pick it into a figure four, break, control lines right there.